Hello, my Flamekin family! Welcome back to Terraria, you guys. So, in between last episode and this, I, for the most part, finished up what we got going on with our base. So I got Glowing Mushroom Biome on the left here, and then we got Jungle Biome on the right. Since our Jungle Biome, I feel as though it's going to get overrun by Crimson, eventually. So I decided that we would take matters into our own hands. The only thing I'm not sure of whether I'm going to do right now is put up um, walls so enemies can't spawn. I don't foresee myself doing that, but it's also a, a possibility, just in case. I mean, I don't want them to come into the base or anything like that. The other annoying thing is, is now the music changes with where I am in the base. But... Also, that's not the end of the world. But what's also cool is we got a crimson altar right here, right by our base. So that's awesome, I think. So if we do need to use it for crafting or anything of that sort, it is right close by. But yeah, so that's what's kind of going on. I don't know why there's water right here. That's kind of annoying. I don't want the water. Go away, water. But I should, I think I'm going to do like a enclosure or another block in the middle. Block of mud that has the jungle or the glowing mushroom biome on it. And then here it looks like not enough jungle has spawned. Or maybe I need jungle background. But... But yeah. So this episode, as far as everything goes, what the plan is, man, is we almost, almost, almost got the twins last episode. So what I want to do is I want to actually get the twins. So let's put everything away. I completed a quest of ours right before the end of our intermittent episode so we got our bounty fish that we need to submit or give to the angler didn't get anything special create potion and some bait put all of our gold away it is midnight i do not want to summon the twins right now because it's the same exact mistake that we made before got six gold for free as taxes good old taxes um, but yeah, what else I plan on doing with this is I want to make a witch doctor house in here, in the jungle, and I want to make a truffle house in the glowing mushroom. So, that'll be pretty, pretty cool, man. Let's collect all of this stuff. Whoops, I did not want to destroy the rich mahogany candle. But as far as what I want to do with this episode, I would like us to explore a little bit more. I try. I kind of would like to get some more drops from Mimics. So maybe we can go down and see if we can run into some Hollow Mimics or some Crimson Mimics. Either way. But we got our melee armor on, our melee stuff equipped. Let's get some penetration. And then let's go down. Which area do we want to go into? We could go underground jungle. Mm -hmm. But I don't know if we entirely want to. I want to get the twins, man. Let's go, let's go right here. And we, we got to get this ice merman, right? Oh, there it was. He died a lot faster than I thought he was gonna. Yeah. So what do we got over here? I would like to explore the underground crimson more so than the hollow because we already have plenty of like souls and light and everything. And we also got this flying knife from 
uh, hollow mimic. Got a trifold map. Well, like one in a gazillion that we have. Get some granite up in here. Alright, let's see. Put ourselves equal. And we want to go down. What was that? Oh, a bat. I do need us to mine some more iron too, so I'm not sure how we're going to go about that if we have a... We just want to do that during a one of the sped up ed episodes, videos. I'm thinking that that's probably going to be the best, best solution, best bet. Here's copper. Only that copper was uh was iron. Got an angler fish. Let's go down here, get some glowing mushrooms or something. Full of night. Yeah. There we go. Get our flying knife out again. An Ichor Stickler. Sticker. Ichor Sticker. It rhymes. I'd have to assume that was intended, right? Anglerfish. So, Anglerfish can, uh, may have a good drop that the bandage, which is, it essentially gets rid of, it doesn't allow you to get debuffed with bleeding so that can be used with the for the onk shield which is the accessory that makes it so that we don't have to worry about any debuffs like ever which would be nice not that we normally have to have a ton of them but just nice to have that reassurance the peace of mind a depth meter So yeah, I don't know about the, uh, the whole walls or not, because I guess I wouldn't be, I wouldn't get annoyed by any means if we had to get, or had to destroy enemies every once in a while while at home. It would actually be beneficial in my opinion. an axe. Good guy. Really isn't too much down here. I just want, what time is it? Just turned into the morning. See, like, these are the guys that I'm... I wouldn't say, Yeah, I, I guess I would say nervous about. Because they can shoot through stuff. Here's a bunch of iron. We're just running out of iron ore, so... Like, majorly. Gotta have it to make us some train tracks. And by train tracks, you get some what I mean. Not train tracks, minecart tracks. What did you guys take damage from? Hmm? Be honest. Did you guys take damage from yourselves? Oh no, my spider. Good spider. Who's a good spider? You're a good spider. Oh. Oh. Um. I think Icar is pretty good because we can make a... Um, if worse comes to worse, we can make a... 
flask, I think they're called, an imbuing flask from the witch doctor, where we can make it so that our melee attacks reduce armor of the enemy, which would actually be pretty beneficial. Purpling, brother, you serve no purpose in my world. What are you taking damage from? Oh, I'm confused. Come on, can I stop being confused? Thank you. How many? We got two souls of night and nine picker. Another soul of night. Nice. Anything down here? No, it looks like there's a... Oh, it's just copper. Too bad it's not iron. You know, I never, I actually genuinely have never had a iron deficiency in hard mode. So that's pretty cool. Wizard hat? Hey man, floating gross. Back up. What is that thing? Oh, it's just a granite elemental. I have defeated 10 floating grosses. I wonder if they're pronounced grosses or if it's like gross or something. Here's what it's supposed to be. There's a Medusa. I'm not actually sure what Medusa drops that special, by the way. Maybe it'd be something super duper cool. Come on. There we go. Nothing special. What's over here? Is this iron? Nope, tungsten. We got a gazillion tungsten, so honestly not concerned about that. Oh, so how's everybody doing? I hope everybody's doing okay with this whole, uh, at least in Minnesota, we have finally, well, I shouldn't say finally, but we have entered an official shelter in place. So essentially now, nobody other, everybody is re highly recommended to stay at home unless they are an essential worker. I, myself, have been declared an essential worker. So that's a little strange. I work at a car dealership. I would not have put my bets on people at car dealerships being essential workers, but look man, I'm not the boss. Give me your guys' thoughts on that. Let me know if you're an essential worker. And if so, what what position you hold hold? Like I would have expected essential workers to essentially be like grocery store employees, um, healthcare, like doctors, all that good stuff. And then oh yeah, it's a mimic. And then besides that, like. Hey, that was kind of rude of you, Mrs. Medusa. Besides healthcare workers and grocery store individuals, employees, I didn't really expect much to be honest. Certainly not my position. But I, I mean, in a legitimate sense, people do need, some people need vehicles, you know what I mean? Like if, if they're sitting there and their car breaks down, what are, what are their options? They can't tell their employer, hey, I don't have a vehicle, so I can't work. But I just feel weird trying to tell people like, hey, Hey brother, you know that uh, we were told to not leave our houses? Why don't you come in and buy a car, huh? Can't hurt. 
Medusa, I'm not sure what you are up to, girl. Oh, what's up, Icker stickers? I mean, your Icker. Just two? Is there other down here? Not sure. Alright, um... It is almost... I mean, it really isn't almost. It is kind of almost nighttime. So we are going to stay up here. And we actually should be able to go fishing. So I think we will do that. Let's see here, though. Got a gazillion wizard hats. Depth meter we can sell, cross necklace we can sell, and trifold map we can sell. Good deal. Banner. You're telling me we don't have. Oh, right here. You're telling me we don't have a giant bat banner? I suppose we probably just have a regular bat banner. Okay, ores go over here, die over there, throwables all the way to the right, and then glowing mushrooms to the left. Let's put our that stuff gold away. I want to talk to our angler. Caught anywhere, slime fish. Let's go slime fish. Started a new series on Doom Eternal, so if you guys enjoy my commentary, um, I would highly support and suggest going to check that out. It's a very fun game so far. Played about an hour of it, and it's kind of the it, it's scratching the itch that I wanted to get scratched for a while. I just didn't find the right game for it. So, I'm hopeful that that goes well and that people are enjoy that. Just as much as you guys enjoy this. Come on, give me a slime fish. Please, before these guys attack me. There we go. One more. Come on, come on. Nice. Just a bass. I actually really like this, uh, the Sky Fracture. By the way, I know there's a counterpart for Crimson. I just don't have easy access to it. So that's why I have not gotten it or gone to it. I don't have easy access to the Crimson Desert is what I'm trying to say or mean what do we get bottomless water bucket this is exactly what I wanted because now I can actually make lakes of my own so like if I want a lake in here in order to fish I can do that so that's awesome I can do the same for jungle And get some cool stuff fishing. Speaking of that, we should open while we're still waiting. We should open up a. Uh, English Logan. We should open up the wooden crates that we've gotten so far. I do also want to put the grand design away. Because we don't need it all the time. I've extended a majority of our... So let's actually get prepared. I've extended a majority of our... Railway in the west side. So now instead of just ending right there, it goes all the way to the end. Just about all the way to the end. I ran out of iron. That's why I was talking about our iron deficiencies. But we want an arcane mana flower. And a warding shark tooth necklace. We'll replace... Uh, let's replace those, because I don't need lava waders. 
while fighting the uh, twins. Anything else that would be beneficial for us? Sorcerer Emblem. I do not need... Yeah, I don't need balloons. Good, that should be good. Let's see, we did collect that already. Do we have the summoning? We do not. So... I believe the summoning takes iron, so let's see what else it takes. We'll figure this stuff out, get this sorted, and then we'll go. Five iron, six souls of light, and three lenses. Six souls of light, and three lenses. One, two, three, four, five. Six souls of light. Come on, brother. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then three lenses. One, two, three. And what do I need to craft it? Apparently one of these things. Alright. So there's that. As far as potions go, let's get us a... Uh, Um, let's get an iron skin potion, let's get a, I mean, mana regeneration, it's not really going to impact anything. Magic power, we got seven of them. Night Owl, just for fun. Hunter, Gravitation, Heart Reach, Builder, Titan, that's really it. Perfect, and then we'll take that. Alright, it's 8 o'clock. Let's get our buff going. Right here. Right here. And then let's, uh... Let's get it going. I think if we press B, equip all of this stuff. Let's, let's go... Actually, we want to be on this side when we're fighting the... Fighting the laser. So let's go all the way over here. Because we want the straightaway while we're killing the green guy. And then we want the bumpy. Excuse me. And we may even um, hop off of the rails in order to. Whoosh. May hop off of the rails in order to kill the guy with the lasers, because it's going to be easier to dodge that one than it will be to dodge this one, the laser guy, because he just shoots straight right beside you. Almost to the end. Oh! Could have just died from that if that does damage to people. Luckily it does not. Alright, you guys ready for this? So we're gonna press... We're gonna summon them. And then... Let's open our map. And we're gonna press B. And we're gonna go from here. Excuse me, where'd he go? Nope, nope, chill. And we got the mana potions just in our, in our inventory, so that's nice. Forty seven damage. I think we're going on appropriate speed. I don't want to go too fast, and I don't want to go too slow. Alright, so he just... Unlocked. Oh my goodness, do I not... Oh, right here. Yeah. Go as fast as you can! Just did 183 damage. Yeah. 
3500 down or 3500 health. 600. All right. So there's that. Let me. I need to just chill out, and we're gonna heal up. We can do some damage to him. But we wanna, we wanna heal to full. Heal right away, good. What does this do? Magic damage reduced by a percentage. Yeah, so I think if we... We go off of the rails. This is gonna be our best bet. Raincoat Zombie has its own. Yeah, let's get rid of that. I think we can do this. Come on, zombie. No, can you not? No! Okay, ah. yeah, so we made less progress right there than we did on our railroad tracks, so I think we're gonna stick to the railroad tracks. We're already at 27 minutes? Oh my goodness. How did, how did this, how did that go by so quickly? Okay, yeah, that's gonna take 10 years to walk all the way over there. So let me just put my boots on. We'll gather our equipment, and then we're going to, uh, we're just gonna end it for today. That's frustrating. But at least we learned, stick to the tracks, and we're gonna have a better, a better time. Rather than zombies and stuff interrupting us. Grave marker, heck off, brother. Let's go back home. I'm gonna organize my inventory, and then we will continue on with our next episode, where I guarantee you we are going to defeat the twins. All right, you guys. If you guys liked it, hit the like button. Consider becoming a part of the Flamican family and subscribing. Let me know any feedback that you guys have in the comment section below. And thank you all for watching. I hope you guys have an excellent day.